asshole. Major asshole. <laughs> Thanks, not that relevant for staying fantastic. I had to start the video over the YouTube, that, that bit's on there. <laughs> Thanks for staying fantastic, fucking hell. Um, it is rookie. I've played a lot. I've lost to two rookie teams, I think, or at least drawn to the rookie teams. Yeah, he's rookie, and uh, I've got a tackle pommer, so that's all right, isn't it? But he's got some inducements, and uh, you know, he's scared with a wizard, and a wizard against armor seven, you never know what's going to happen. But um, <laughs> thank you very much, thank you very much for the resub there. Thanks for staying fantastic. Brilliant that the YouTube videos is going to start with assholes. I don't know. I think I'm playing really bad at the moment. Maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll find a way to lose. Yeah, but that that that, that YouTube video there that was linked here. I'll even I'll even share it again in case you in case you miss Lean Gary's link there. Look at this, right? In 50 seconds there, I'll put it out. 50 seconds, right? How how is that even? I couldn't I couldn't do that if it was fucking life size. <laughs> <laughs> if that was an ogre, if it was an ogre, maybe I'd be able to do it like that. But he's done a halfling. That's just fucking crazy, isn't it? That's absolutely crazy. Unbelievable. Unbelievable how good they are. Ah, oh, was that a space pose quote? Right. <laughs> there was a rule, yes, but then that was changed because, um, well. There's several reasons why it could have been changed, but whatever they were, it was done. <laughs> so there you are. <laughs> it has been jammed. Oh dear. Watch the movie. I will watch it. I will watch it. I promise. I promise. I'll watch the movie. Yes, I will promise I will watch it. <laughs> All right, he's got hack phlegm. Um, should I kick for the one turn or just receive to murder him? Receive to murder him. He hasn't got a wizard, has he? He didn't take the wizard. He chose a bribe and a bribe and a babe instead of a wizard. So that's good. The wizard was really his chance to uh, to win the game, wasn't it? Hackflam's pretty good, isn't he? He's basically edge five, and edge five strength three gutter is all right, isn't it? I mean, okay, he hasn't got block, but tail is sometimes going to be useful with him being strength three. He's not terrible. <laughs> not going to call anybody dumb, Lean Gary. It's not dumb either, is it? It's just bad at blood ball. <laughs> <laughs> um, or maybe suboptimal. <laughs> Pom. Pom's good, isn't it? I'm glad I have the Pommer back. I think I just won all the games due to Pom, to be honest. I think every game I won was because I had a Pommer. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the rule change was pretty dumb, yeah. Um, it was either because of the people in... It was... Yeah, yeah, I don't know what it is. Um, piling on has not been changed in Blood Bowl 2. It has just been removed in Blood Bowl 2016, which is the best change, best change to do with it. Everybody and their fucking mother thinks of a way to change palm, and they're like, ah, oh, do it this, and then make it a foul, and make them not stack, and do all this other bollocks. But um, I think just removing it was the best. So good for Games Workshop. Um, right. Now what? Now where was I? Um, oh, Shaking scored up to 16, that's pretty good. 
Um, yeah, it could have been because of the private leagues. Um, it definitely wasn't because of the um, because of the data. They said it. They looked at the data, but they they obviously didn't. The data was absolute just lies. Um, they certainly did not look at any data and base their decision on that. So, but whatever it is, they changed it for whatever reason. It is what it is. Ouch, humorous chimp. No, you can't. I know somebody who's who's very smart, and he's just shit at Blood Bowl, shit at Warhammer, shit at, shit at Magic. But he's, you know, he's fucking earning a fortune for uh, the people that make the people that make some game. Um, Crisis is it? Crytek. I think he works for Crytek. Is that a company? Could be, couldn't it? Gonna be a horrible team. I went for looking at your vids. Glorious. Glorious. I think so. Hey. Crisis. The make crisis, isn't it? Is that right? Cry crisis. Yeah. Crytek, something like that. That's it. That's the one. You know what I And do you know what? Do you know what's funny? I'm gonna sell one of my friends down the river here, but it's alright. He'll he'll never watch the he'll never watch the VOD. Well it's the old it's the old uh, don't look at the VOD argument here. But um I'm just gonna go for two D with block, because why not? Well that's why not. It would have been a knockdown. Um we were staying at my friend's house, because the, the, my friend who works for Crytek lives in Nottingham. I don't know if that's where Crytek are based or whatever, but um, he lives in Nottingham. And uh, we're at his house. And my friend, one of my friends, who works in construction, every time... He go past something that he worked on. He says, I built that school. Or, I built that stadium. Or, I built whatever it was. He always says, I built that, right? And, uh, and then what is that? Was, and, and we know him, right? We've known him for years. We all know he works at Crytek, right? And on his wall is like some kind of platinum disc or gold disc or whatever of some game. And he's like... He's like, uh, and then the construction guy's like, oh, what's this on the wall? Did you, did you, did you get like a special collector's edition or something? And he's like, no, I made it. <laughs> I made the game. And, and then he goes, oh, well, you didn't make it. You just, you just worked on it. And I thought, wow, you fucking knobhead after you say it, after every single building we go past, he just says, I built that. And then when he fucking says he made that game. He's like, well, you didn't make it at all, did you? You just worked on it. I thought, wow, you knobhead. Right, anyway, um, it is Hackflem, yes. Hello, Sounds Stu. Sorry about getting that off my off my chest, but I thought it was very mean. And now I've told 92 people, but then you don't know who he is. And, uh, you know, he's probably not watching. And if he is, I just thought you were a cunt, mate. <laughs> That's easy, isn't it? <laughs> All by himself. <laughs> His bare fucking hands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Briggs on with dodge and optional. I don't know, man. Ever since I got surfed by not having it on optional, I've like, I think I've got to have it on optional. Should be able to get that. That was that was disrespectful. That doing the uh, doing the pass, but I really wanted to get her skilled up, even though it's game number twenty of twenty, and I'm not going to be playing any more games with this team. I still skilled up a player. That's that's smart, that isn't it? Is Skaven a hard team to play? Yes and no. It's a funny one. 
It's Skaven are a funny one because you can just click the end zone and win. But um you can also like not. <laughs> they're a funny they're a funny team. They really it really is. Um Right. Blitz there. So we can get a follow up block with him, which is alright. Yeah, they're hard when the game gets difficult. Yeah, exactly. But then, when it's easy for them, it's really easy. So, three dice with tackle. Let's fucking go. Three dice with block and tackle and piling on. Are the worst tier one? Well, K. Foolsey is not talking like a real person there. <laughs> He's talking like a tabletop person. Which is substantially different to uh, this kind of game, isn't it? Uh, the season's not over again. No, no, no. This is. I don't know how long the season's been going for. I don't know what the command is in Extra Arms, but either. Um, in NAF, exactly, yeah. In NAF-style tournaments, they are absolutely the worst Tier 1. But then, if they weren't the worst Tier 1 team, they'd be the best Tier 2 team, right? Um, but in this kind of situation, they're one of the best teams, aren't they? Of course they are. Because they, they get Claw Pom and One Turners, both of which pretty good. Um, right, I probably should have marked him with a Mighty Blow, shouldn't I, in case he stood up? But, um. Yep. Stupid match making. Yeah, that's instead Necro, exactly, yeah. And if Necro were, were Tier 1, they'd be the worst Tier 1 team. Yeah. Oh, absolutely, yeah, because it's just one plus movement to get a one turner, isn't it? That's the thing. And even if you don't, it's two pushes. So, like, and they've got movement nine, so yeah, they're the best. They're the best one TD team for sure. And uh, one turn touchdown team, and... Yeah, they get killers as well. The problem with Kemri is the 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 problem with Kemri is in NAF style tournaments, the best teams are like elfy teams, aren't they? Woodies, dark elves, even Zons are a bit elfy. Lizards can be a bit elfy. Um, undead can be a bit elfy with all the ghouls, because like you've got to win games, haven't you? There's no point drawing games. So teams like Orcs do a bit shit because they draw a bunch, and then. Um, what you want is to is to win, to win the tournament. <laughs> it did go wrong for Muldripster once because he was he was winning like seven nil and conceded, so lost eight <laughs> seven. Oh man, he's got he's got to run a foul. You didn't learn this from my videos. I don't care that you got a bribe. You can't do that. Come on, man. I'll do that. This is semi reliable, 75%. They're not that bad at picking up the ball. The problem is just like being slow and, you know, if they get stuck, they're a bit shit, aren't they? I don't care if you've got two bribes. I don't care. It's not on. I'm not having it. Not on my watch. I pushed him too far away, I can't fucking blutz now. Well, I guess you've done the, this block first. I guess I got the uh, push. Nice of him to remind me that I've got a I've got a bribe though. <laughs> Should zone blitzers have gas? Arguably, I guess. 
They are more than good without it, but they do fall off. What they need is higher base stats, isn't it? They, they're, they're really good at low TV, and then they fall off at higher TV, so more access would naturally would naturally benefit them. But I think if they if they had some players that cost a bit more, that wouldn't make them so good at high TV, but then at low TV, like, they cost a bit more with better stats, but then it'd help them at high TV, wouldn't it? Um... Yeah, he'd have to be in. He has got two bribes, so he'd have to like one in thirty-six the bribe after one in three in the foul. But it's still, it's still nuts when he could have just fouled the Lino probably or a thrower. Like here, it's a Lino, isn't it? This is this is fine. There you go. Yeah, exactly, Squirrel Dude, yeah. Yeah. Exactly, Rat and Blood, exactly, you don't want to, no. do here. I really want to pile on but now I'm scared because I've realised he's got the bribe still on. I don't really want to pile on. <laughs> if he didn't have a bribe this fucker would be getting piled on straight away. But um, without it, one, two, three, four, five, six, I guess. Hit him, maybe he's pile on. Jam some players in the way. Look at this safe moves first. Look at this lad. This absolute lad doing safe moves first. What the fuck is this? A stun. Oh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't make a cage. Oop for go. <laughs> I neglected to make a cage, and then double wonder dodge. Superb. Absolutely superb. I didn't pile on a KO. No. I did pile on a KO. Oh, fuck. That was by mistake. That was by mistake. I didn't realise. Sorry, Dathan, I don't know where you've been for the last six games from this team. But, um, it's been a theme. <laughs> it's been a theme of the last uh, six games that I've played a bit shit. Gone 1 3 2. Which is terrible, isn't it? No. No, that was, uh, that was bad. Shit and wrong, you could say.
could have done the dodge, couldn't he, with that arch five? And would have had dodge for it. So it was a mistake there. Should have cut the corner. I think I've seen a surf. Do this. <laughs> proudest, proudest moment of my life, that's sir. <laughs> yeah, no reserves. Yeah. Um, got sort of ten, ten men for the rest of the match. <laughs> it's complicated. It was complex, that wasn't it? Proud of myself. Oh, okay, oh, yeah, the run-up. The run-up was the killer. Absolutely. Absolute. 100%. Yes, 10 men. I, I don't want to assume their gender. <laughs> absolutely careful. Absolutely.
Oh yeah, I've just muted now, and I was trying to say shit. Sorry for not muting then. I've been I've been muting. Fuck. Sorry. Sorry. I tried to mute, but obviously I'd failed. Um, the gutters have been pommed a little bit and surfed. Yeah, I'd definitely wait for movement. Yeah, hundred percent. Wait for the gutter to roll plus movement. And um. Hey, and uh, <laughs> I won't complain. I don't know. I don't like it. I don't like people doing it. Um. <laughs> right, let's punch things. Punch this one. Good. No, I could have got a follow-up block from that one. Okay, that's just a push there, so we pom this this little fucker now then. <sighs> Greed it. Yes. Uh, no, you still want to try and stall it, but I mean, it depends how many players you're on, you know. If you if you feel like sometimes you're gonna have to score, if since you can just so that you can score, you know. At the end of the day, scoring is better than not scoring. So ah, fuck off! you've got to do, you've got to do what you've got to do at the end of the day. I didn't do a full run up. Shit, gonna get spotted. Probably just for a stun. No, did not, did not get spotted, so that's all right. No, probably, no, it's probably bad, wasn't it? I mean, guess it shouldn't matter. You can, yeah. Um, it's, yeah, it's interesting, because you're movement nine, right? So you, you just, you just play it like a normal bash team, just make two dice blocks and everything, and then if you get overwhelmed one place, then you've got to just go somewhere else and stuff like that. I've been doing it a lot lately, Kyle. <laughs> I've been doing it a lot. Um, playing fast and loose now, there's no money involved. <laughs> Basically. And I've done it in Rebel just to try and get, you know, SPPs on my guys. And I'll probably be greeting in, in my, in my quarter-final match. Um... That's coming up. I'll probably. I know, right? I know. Um, in the quarter final match, I'll probably be greeting because I'll be hitting fucking stand firm, claw mighty blow guys. So I'll probably have to have probably have to greed them to try and get knockdowns. It's going to be really tough, actually, the rebel quarter final. Really tough. Right? Can I make a three D? Um. Three, four, five, six, seven. Yes. Yes, we can. Pylon, obviously. Boo, didn't fucking die. <laughs> yes, rat and blue. Yes, <laughs> it was. A, it was an absolute massacre. Not only did I win against them, they were they were unlucky as fuck, and I was lucky as fuck. It was absolutely nuts. It was one of the biggest dicings I've ever participated in. Um, so yeah.
Oh, those those kids live. Not those kids live. I don't which kid. I don't know which kids live. You're talking about now. They're not in blue. <laughs> I like it. A lot of people don't know. Lucas feel dice. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Um, which game are you talking about? Rebel? Rebel was the Chuck Norris guy. was the Chuck Norris team. And I slaughtered that Kislev. I played Kislev on Xbox, yes. I played versus Kislev. I was Dwarfs and he was Kislev. He, he was zero zero one one Kislev and made the playoffs. And he was executed. And then... But yeah, also Kislev. Kislev in, in Rebel, I executed them... The reason they only had Chuck Norris was because I absolutely murdered their team and won. Oh, I play on Xbox. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Durun's nemesis kids love you. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, right. Okay. I like it. Um, Malmi, I think, has a runs a runs a rat ogre in box and stuff. Um, he never ditched it. Because because he got he got claw palm rogue. To be fair, if you get a claw palm rogue, if you get a claw palm rogue, you don't ditch it because three claw palm is better than two claw palm. <laughs> um, so yeah, if you get doubles and get a claw for him, he's pretty good. What's next on Xbox? It's actually a good player. It's uh, it's Olivier Dulac. Um, so that's disappointing because I might not even get the money on on uh, on Xbox. <laughs> might not even make it to the money. Jim Shard. Um, no, definitely not LOS, no, because he'll just die on the right. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll like the Rat Ogre at low TV. Young but good. Is he young? Oh, does he play tabletop, does he? How old is he? I mean, I'm, I'm not like, I'm not, you know, trying to hit on him or anything, but <laughs> what do you call young? <laughs> Super aggressive. He's got the Wizards, the shitter is being his, his stadium, that's the thing. It's at his stadium, so if it was at my stadium, it would be alright, because we're about the same TV. We're both like 1850 TV, but he's got the fucking Wizard Stadium. And he's got, you know, I've got Dwarves, and he's got Dark Elves with an Edge 5 Blitzer. So... A, a, a wizard on each side is a lot better for the elves than it is for me, isn't it? So if I'd been at home, I would have been pretty confident of winning because he wouldn't have the wizard. But with him having the wizard, I think it's going to be very, very tough. Very tough game. Uh, probably not. No, probably don't start with it. Uh, there are some new ones, yeah. There's been, um, there's been like the kick, kick teammate and stuff, hasn't there? Stuff like that. But, um. And fucking. Big Mouth, or whatever the fuck it is. Ah, both him and his brother. Yeah, because I saw there was a Dulac on, uh, on Fumble. When I was looking at Fumble, uh, when they were th talking about who's representing Fumble in the cross platform cup, I thought, oh, there's a Dulac there. I wonder if he's related. <laughs> and obviously he is. Yeah, I like the idea of combining some of the shit skills, yeah. It's funny, you know, the three adjips on this team, what the fuck. Guard on each side. This is a quite a good setup, this, isn't it, actually? No, oh, no, then there's both. No, no, I've got to have both guards or all the adjip on one side. I guess it's alright. Let's do this actually. Oh, I can't do that because I haven't got ten men. Oh, balls! The trident, tried and true. 25, which is young in tabletop. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. Uh, 
Um, I liked pass block and kick off return to be combined. And kick and dirty player, even though kick and, even though dirty player isn't really bad. Kick's a bit narrow, isn't it? Yeah, I don't like really like the throw. It's it's kind of alright, isn't it? But I just don't like it that much. Tarabarala started with a rover, I remember. Rovers are pretty good. Yeah, definitely get your apple. Get your apple in. <laughs> Your whole throw is the only one. <laughs> yeah, kick isn't terrible, but it's just it's hard to take, isn't it? It's hard to take. That's the that's the problem with kick is it's a hard it's a hard skill to actually pick on anybody. Yeah, foul appearance is disturbing presence, yeah, absolutely. I mean they used to be, but the the reason they split them is because they didn't want mutations to be too good, because mutations were doubles only. And then they made them normals. And they didn't want uh, they didn't want them to be too powerful. But yeah, you, if you if you got both, you might pick it. Yeah, but you're never going to pick one or the other, are you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it's hard. It's okay with Amazons, isn't it? Because they line and just get normals. So Norse and uh, Amazons can take it on Linos. Dwarves can get it on Runners because they run out of skills pretty quickly. So like. But it's hard to pick it, isn't it? You know, you're not gonna. It's hard to pick it over a good skill. <laughs> um, that's the problem. Sage took it on a war dancer. On your block, I thought. Well, do you know what? Funnily enough, careful. Funny that you say that. Funny that you say that, right? Because look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. This is a the mo the biggest um the biggest uh the biggest build up ever to a, an unexciting player. There you go. Boom, kick. Hey. Blodge, sure hands, movement seven, strength four, hop goblin, with kick. <laughs> Because there wasn't really anything that benefited the player. I guess kickoff return would have benefited the player. But kick benefited the team. So, absolute unit. The uh, Hobgoblin cunt is fucking jacked. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly, yeah. If, the, if it, what the skills... Like, if a skill access isn't that good... Like, I guess your edge for sure hands is a line, all right? If your skill access isn't good, so you're just getting general, then um, yeah, it's quite acceptable, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Rogue, yeah, pie, yeah, Juggernaut probably first, to be fair. Juggernaut. Makes him good, doesn't it? And then piling on, and then probably boot on the third skill. If he doesn't get claw, claw, the claw. The rogue piling is pretty cool, yeah. It is looking a good old 2-1 grind, yeah. Yeah, I don't think I'm even going to try and stop him scoring, just run back. Pom. Yeah, I, w I would pick Claw over Block, personally. Some people wouldn't. 
but they're boring. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> that's what you get for rolling dice in this game. <laughs> Absolutely banged on. Three dice with block and tackle, let's go. That's two dead gutters. <laughs> it's a shame because it, he was a nice guy. He was a nice guy in chat look. Um, I learned to play looking your vids. And then... Get how do I say thank cunt. you? <laughs> Killing his gutters. Fuck off. Absolutely murdering the living fuck out of him is how I say... <laughs> no, I didn't need... No, I didn't need this. Because he's got a defensive one. <laughs> uh, let's let's do go here and then go another one as well, right? Oh, he's got tail! Oh shit! He's got a tail! Oh no! Oh oh, he's got a tail! Oh oh, he's got a tail! Oh oh, he's got a tail! Oh. oh Oh, he had a tail. <laughs> Deserved a death, absolutely. <laughs> like this already, don't you, Dragon? Good. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe, Skuro. Maybe. You just got, I mean, it would just had two two pluses anyway, it wouldn't even if I'd made that. That was a stupid dodge to make. It would have only made an extra one in 30, so. I don't know, I've got tackle on him, so. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know what he uploaded it in. I think he uploaded it into like a minus strength or something. <laughs> He's got two proper heads, hasn't he? Most of them don't. When they get the mutations, they don't get, but he's got two proper heads. Two normal sized heads. He's getting the foul in. Come on, bribe veil. Boo. Alright, thanks. See you. See you. Careful. <laughs> Xbox, it's amazing. <laughs> When did Fumble start? No idea, Billy. No idea. I, I know I joined it late. 2003, maybe, is when it started. But when I said no idea, maybe I'm lying. But uh, I couldn't say with any confidence. I don't know why I found it late. Because I found it one time, and I just couldn't work out how to fucking use it. <laughs> Arrow, Pedro, play 20 games, so this is probably the last game. Uh, oh, there you go, 24. Oh, yeah, K Fool started. At least 2004, yeah, I think maybe it's 2003. I don't know I don't know why I've got a feeling about 2003. 2007 is when I, when I joined. I found it on the internet and then I couldn't work out how to fucking use it so I didn't play on it. Yeah, it's not that bad to give block to them. Night. Three, six, nine. Ten versus nine. Good. GG. Enough for me. Okay, GG. <laughs> Uh, 
There is no way to prevent your TD. Oh, that's fair enough. Zunk was a founding member. <laughs> Back when he was only 60. <laughs> Hackfam does have dodge. Yeah, Hackfam's a gutter with plus... Plus, uh, plus strength. And kind of edge five. Cheers. What a lovely fella. I think he is respect conceding, yeah. That's quite nice, isn't it? <laughs> I don't endorse it, but it's his time, and if he doesn't want to play it, that's up to him, isn't it? I'd have rather played the rest of the match, obviously, but it's fair enough. That's what he wants to do, that's what he wants to do. 17 AV breaks, on and level AV breaks in one half. 26 blocks <laughs> in the 17 AV breaks. <laughs> there was a lot of piling on, wasn't there? Four dodges failed them all. Superb. Yeah, it was 10 versus 9, but he was going to take pom hits and mighty blows and piling and fouls, so he probably wouldn't have had an amazing chance to stop. He would have had some chance to stop, of course he would have done. He definitely didn't have no chance to stop it. Right, cheeky guard. And let's have a look here. Team's just got a lot better now. Ooh, I think I think I'd go guard there. I think that's a guard. Uh, it looks a lot better when it's got some actual fucking guards on the team, doesn't it? Holy shit. Um, I think this one's be wrestle now, right? We've got eight got eight block already, so we can go a wrestle. Get a wrestler. And uh yeah, that's like a pretty good team now, isn't it? Shame to shame to give up on them now, but then the record isn't great, and that's twenty uh, no, it's not the end of the stream. I'll have another game. Uh, pick AV. I'm not going to pick AV. Uh, movement could be an option. I'll probably take guard, though, and then there'd be one, two, three, four guarders. And a tackle Palmer, and that's a pretty good team, then, isn't it? All the edge ups. But, um, yeah, not the best record in the world. I played a bit shit for a lot of games. Right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.